and today we are off to Cabri World. So I'm going to bring you along and see what adventures we get up to. I know we've got afternoon tea booked, mm -hmm. but um, apart from that, I, I, I haven't been to Cabri World in forever, so it shall be an interesting adventure. We shall go on together. I got a swelty with me too. <laughs> We've just arrived and we're about to do the Bourneville experience. Not sure what that is, but let's go and find out. So the Bourneville experience, according to the Cadbury's website, it uncovers the history of Bourneville village, explains the fascinating Cadbury family heritage and showcases the nostalgic memorabilia of the brand. One thing you might not know about me is I absolutely love miniatures. And this is what this is. It's a miniature of the Bourneville village. This is probably why I was so drawn to Warhammer because of it being miniatures and Imperialis being miniature miniatures or mini minis as we say. Along with the miniatures and the TV showing all the history, they've got all the memorabilia as well. And my favourite has to be this horse and cart. a fun experience. I uh, got to write our names in chocolate and apparently mine was a lot more fancy than Swell Cheese. <laughs> I wasn't expecting fancy. <laughs> of course, expect the unexpected. Right, now we're off to the 4D cinema. Now, not sure what to expect here either, so let's go. Well, that was certainly an experience. Right. That was certainly an experience. Um, yeah, 4D cinema. So the seat moved. There was no water or anything like that. There was or a bit wind. Of wind. Was there a bit of wind? That's a bit of wind. Oh, I didn't realise that. Yeah. Yeah, so that was. You couldn't film in there, obviously. So I didn't film, but. Um, yeah, <laughs> it was it was interesting. And the funny thing is, this whole place smells like chocolate and all I want to do is eat. So <laughs> we're going to go and have afternoon tea now. I'm back home now. Um, 
That's because I had a bit of sensory overload at Cadbury World and I had to come home. Um, so unfortunately I didn't get to do the tour, but they allowed me to reschedule a, um, a visit. So I get to do the tour again but, um, and I'm gonna do it in July. So that's good. Um, so I don't miss out on the free chocolate or whatever um, else you get. And I don't have to miss out on thing. And they also gave me an access wristband as well. So I don't have to wait in the normal queue, which is good. So yeah, that's, that's all positive. Um, just means that I gotta drive up the M5 again <laughs> with all of its roadworks at the moment, which is crazy. Most of it's a 50, which is oh just painstaking, but hey ho. This is one of my presents I got today. It's a three-headed teddy bear from Killstar. And I got it from my best friend Katie and Jamie. So thank you! <laughs> I love him. He is so cute. And he glows in the dark as well. This bit glows in the dark. So, yeah, super cute. Super cute. Um, yeah, apart from that, probably gonna go for a nap or something. Um, because I'm not.